The late Queen Elizabeth II reportedly had a bizarre bedroom habit that she always insisted upon during her annual stay at Balmoral. Following the late Queen's death last September, this is King Charles' first time hosting summer at the Scotland-based residence, carrying on his mother's long-standing tradition. Many members of the royal family, such as the Prince and Princess of Wales, are set to joining the King and Queen Camilla later this month. According to former royal butler Paul Burrell, who worked alongside the late Princess Diana for 10 years, has opened up about one thing that the Queen was adamant about whilst staying at Balmoral. He said, she loved the fact that her bedroom windows were open every night and she would get the fresh air from the highlands every night. Prince William voted most likely person to unite the US as he tops leader poll speaking on behalf of Slingo, Mr. Brill added, and isn't it ironic that she died there? I mean, she died in the home which she loved, a home which had barely been touched since Queen Victoria lived there 100 years earlier and she loved that frugal way of life. From August until early October, she, Queen Elizabeth II, never closed her bedroom windows. He added, she slept in her bed and it was almost like the princess and the pea, there were that many sheets and blankets and covers and eider downs that it was hard to find her, because sometimes that bedroom was very very cold, especially in October in Aberdeenshire. Queen Elizabeth II died at Balmoral on September 8 last year, with the royals set to be at the very location on the one-year anniversary. King set for difficult summer as monarch can no longer do what he wants although the day is set to be a sad day for the king and the rest of the royal family, it will allow them to all be together to remember the late queen. To mark the first anniversary, the Prince and Princess of Wales are expected to lead tributes to the late Queen. With palace officials stating that no plans are underway for any public or private family gatherings, a source told the Mirror that William and Kate will use the occasion to look forward. They added, the royal family has been in transition since then and following the coronation, and conclusion of the summer holidays, there will be an exception to see what is next. Don't miss! Kate's chat to diffuse tension with Meghan so strained her fingers were white, details, royal family live, Meghan and Harry's £3 million film deal insulting, expert, live. King wants strip Meghan of her royal title even if she becomes president, exclusive, with Kate and William set to lead tributes, the King will mark the first anniversary quietly and privately at Balmoral. Although set to join the King will be Princess Anne and the Duke and Duchess of Edinburgh. Kate and William will also bring their three children, Prince George, 10, Princess Charlotte, 8, and Prince Louis, 5 to spend time with their grandfather and family. Now take